Hey, um, do you mind if I come in for a minute? Oh, yeah, they told me to go home early because I seem sick. Thankfully, it won't be too much out of my paycheck since I picked up those two other shifts this week. Huh? Oh, no, I, uh, I feel fine. Am I acting odd? Sorry, I, uh, I hadn't realized. No, I'm not sick, I promise. I guess I've just been distracted all day. I've just been kind of stuck in my thoughts. Does that make sense? <laughs> How do I feel? Well, I guess I feel tired. I feel like I've been drained of all energy and I can't get it back, you know? It feels like energy is water and I'm a cup, but someone just poked a bunch of holes in me and now I can't hold any water. Yeah, drained. That's a really good way to put it, actually. I feel like drained and almost lethargic. Like, no matter how much sleep I get, I never feel like I actually have enough energy. Huh? I mean, I fed fairly recently. About, like, Two weeks ago? Whatever the last time you and I fed each other was. No, that's fairly normal. At least it is for me. Whoever always told me that I had a small appetite for an incubus. I think that most of the lost demons have an appetite like vampires do. You typically need blood about like once a week, right? Right. That's what I thought. If that's typically what a typical incubi needs, but I've never really needed that much. I just need some every once in a while. I don't think that there's been anything that could have... Oh shit. Nothing is wrong. <laughs> exactly. Actually, I think I might have just figured out what's going on. I think you're onto something with the idea of there's been a change in my life that caused an increase in my appetite, but I don't think it's the type of change you're thinking of. No, it's nothing to do with how much I've been working and not getting enough sleep. It's actually something pretty... good, in comparison, depending on how you look at it. What? Uh no, I'm not flustered. I just, um... <clears throat> Sorry, it's just that... It's nothing I thought would happen. At least, not like this. Uh, Alright, so, um... <sighs> How else was this gonna be awkward? You mind if I sit next to you? This might take a while to explain. So, I'm an incubus, right? I mean, you already know that, obviously. And since I'm an incubus, I feed off of desire, want, attraction, and all those sorts of feelings. Feeding off people who are experiencing those emotions is what keeps me, well, alive. It's what we live off of. But what most people don't realize is that when lost demons experience these feelings, we actually burn for our energy reserves faster. Not like immediately, but usually have to feed sooner than we would if we didn't, I guess. Of course, almost all of us experience this in small ways. Like, you know, passing someone attractive on the street. Then that's fine. Something small like that has hardly any effect at all. But if the attraction is stronger, it takes more out of us. Yeah, so, um, the degree of the attraction or want has a pretty big part in it. So just thinking someone looks nice or passing a desire to hold someone's hand takes about as much energy as, like, I don't know, clutching my fist for a few seconds. But if it's someone I desire to have a deeper, or intimate connection with, then my attraction to them is going to take more of a toll on me. 
but um, a lover degree of attraction is important. So is for, well, I guess for the exposure to the person at the center of the attraction. Like, the more time I, I spend around them, the more of our energy it uses because uh, those wants are stronger when I'm around them. Not to mention that the more time I spend around them, the more likely it is that I'll want them even more, and then I need to feed more often. So that would obviously be a problem if the person I wanted was someone I work with, or someone I cross paths a lot. Or if it's someone I live with. Huh? Uh, um, oh, I just said, um, if it's a really close friend. You know, like, one you see every day. It would be a problem. Yeah. But uh, what I'm trying to say is that I'm perfectly fine. No illness or unusual amount of stress. I'm just experiencing a larger amount of attraction than I was before. Yeah, I, I guess that's what I'm saying. There's someone that I've uh, gotten really attracted to, and I guess it's having more of an effect on me than I realized. Oh, hells, you, you don't want to know. No, you really don't. It's kind of... It would make things weird. But just trust me, okay? You don't want to know. Listen, I'm gonna go. I'll figure something out. I just need to do this on my own. Okay? <gasps> hey, what are you doing? Are you taking my pulse? Well... Yeah, my heart rate is increased. This is an embarrassing topic to talk about. C can I please just... What do you mean? How can my blood smell with it? How can you even smell when I'm not even... Look, I told you. It's no one. Quit asking who it is. Sorry, I don't think I heard you right. What, what did you just ask me? You want to know if you're the one I have feelings for? <sighs> Fine. Yes, it's you. I didn't mean to fall for you, I swear, but I, I did. I didn't think I wanted you so bad, but the more I thought about you, the more attracted I became. I started to like you more than I should, and I... I, I couldn't help it. It just... It feels so good to want you. Thinking about you and about how you feel about me. It feels amazing. It felt so natural to crave you, like it was an instinct. So I kept thinking about you, even though I knew it was wrong, and a bad idea. But now I'm way too far gone, and I... I don't know how I'm gonna fix it. I don't want to feed off of anyone besides you, but I think I've just gotta ruin that. What do you mean? Of course I did. I just told you that I want you. How could I not have? Hold on. That kiss, was that to give me energy? Or was that like an actual kiss? Like a romantic kiss? R romantic? So then, you like me too? Shit, we both should have said something sooner. I definitely feel a lot more energized than I do right now. <laughs> really? 
You want to keep going? Oh, I'm definitely game. I'm craving more than just some energy. And if you're willing, I'm going to kiss you until we both fall asleep in each other's arms. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. Holy fuck, it feels so good to kiss you. I mean, I don't know if we've done this before when we've fed each other, but, but this... This feels different. It feels better. Oh yeah? You want to see if feeding off me feels any different now that we're together? Then be my guest. I always like the feeling of your teeth in my neck and your lips in my throat. Uh. <sighs> well, I'm glad to hear I taste good. I put a lot of heart into my blood. <laughs> well, if you don't like my puns, just kiss me again so I don't have to save them. <laughs> So, um, now that my puns have sufficiently silenced, are we still up for kissing until we fall asleep? Sounds perfect to me. Now come back here before I start saying stupid things again. Hey guys and gals, um, Zan here. Uh, first of all, I just want to say thank you for listening to this audio and um sorry if I sound like different uh it's because I'm sick right now so yeah if I sound like a little bit oh yeah if I sound different because I'm sick I, I don't know what else to say um but yeah um any, anyway I ho hope you enjoyed this audio uh Shout out to uh, Soft Like Static for writing this script. Uh, as always, a, a great script, uh, as per usual. Yada yada yada. I mean, I don't, I don't have to say much else, do I? Um, oh my god. Whew. Anyway, um. <laughs> How are you guys doing today? Um, holy shit. Uh, yeah, you, you guys having a good day and all of that stuff? Yeah? No? Yeah? I'm, uh, I'm having a decent day, I guess. I, I don't really know. It's been kind of shit, to be honest. Like, fucking, what's it called? Um, yeah, I think... Uh, last night it was like really hard to get to sleep and then I, I woke up at five and then I was awake for a bit and then I fell asleep again for like an hour and then I've, I've pretty much been up since like seven so yeah that's been fun I guess I don't know um, so yeah <sighs> I took the day off work because I'm too fucking sick to do anything I mean, I, I, yeah, obviously I can fucking record, duh, but like, my, my main job, like my full-time, sorry, sorry if you heard that, my main time, like my full-time job requires me to, to, you know, um, move around a lot and all of that, and I'm very slow and sluggish, so I can't really do much, so yeah, but if I could, I would. I just can't, but like, oh well, 
I don't know what I'm supposed to do, you know? I do. <sighs> yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. Oh. Uh, anyway, um, what do I even say? Jesus. Um, yeah, sorry, I, I don't know what to say here. Yeah. I'm just gonna, um, I'll go to question of the day, because, because, yeah, um, so, today's question of the day is, um, I, I don't know, like, sorry if my sniffing's getting annoying, I can't fucking help it, um, god, I fucking hate being sick, uh, Today's question of the day is, um, I don't know. How am I supposed to know? Maybe it's, um, uh, um, I want to look one up, but I don't know. Um, what am I doing? What am I doing? I don't know. I don't know. Um, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, uh, oh, fuck me. Question of the day. Question of the day. Question of the day. It's, um, oh my god, I can't fucking think of anything. Um. <sighs> my question of the day is, uh, oh my god, dude, I'm so fucking sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm being such a fucking idiot. God, oh, just think. Just think. Um. Well, what's your favorite, uh, what's your favorite crisp flavor? I mean, chip flavor, crisp, crisps, crisps, it's crisps. Amer Americans call them chips, make no fucking sense. Um, yeah, yeah, chip. What's your favorite chip, crisp, crisp, chip flavor? Um, you know, you got like ready salted or original, whatever it's called, you got cheese and onion, you got salt and vinegar, and then you got like, what, what else? Uh, uh, I don't even know. Uh, in the UK we have prawn cocktail. Uh, cock. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know. I would say my favorite is probably just like original, already salted. That's just always like a good one. Like an, an easy one to fall back on, you know, like, you know what you're going to get with that one, and like with cheese and onion, it could, it could be shit. But this, like, fucking thingy, is, is good, it's just always good, you know? Um, but, but yeah, anyway, um, sorry about like me delaying this and being a fucking idiot and all that shit, I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. Um. I'm, I'm just gonna go, cause like, yeah, and also sorry if you're gonna shit in the background, I don't know why the fuck it's making a noise in the background when I've, I've, like, I, I, there's no noise in the background, like, you know, there's nothing loud going on, it just happens randomly, it's so annoying, I'm just fucking pissed off about it. Um, yeah, anyway, I'm gonna go, have a nice day, yada yada, bye bye, love you, bye.